Hey guys, how's it going? So here I have a Model 3 using Navigate on Autopilot and we're doing this in Local Street just to see how it performs if we ignore the directives from the navigation which is going straight instead of making the turn as it recommended. So here there's a lot of opening for left turns and the lanes marking is only in the center for the most part um, the left hand side is actually a center divider but autopilot is doing quite well it's hugging the center lane really well and it's not going over the center divider because there's no lane marking there as you can see again lane openings no issue for autopilot at all and stop and go traffic very smooth as you can see so here we're approaching we're supposed to turn left here but we're going to go straight and it did not try to do anything other than keep going straight. Um, so in local street, it doesn't work like the highway where it actually moved from interchange and exit lane. It actually continues going straight despite uh, the direction on the navigation system. So here we will continue to go straight. There will be a curve at the end of the video where the center divider meets another left-hand turn. There won't be any lane marking, so we'll see how it does. Uh, the lane marking will just be in between the two lanes here in the center. Um, we're going to make sure that our hands is near the steering wheel just in case we need to take control immediately. But you'll see that in a moment. So let's continue here. I'm going to speed this video up. Okay, so here we go. We're about to make that uh, steep turn there, as you can see ahead. No lane markings, but it made that turn perfectly. If this video or my channel has helped you decide to purchase a Model S X or 3, please consider using a refer code. This gives you and ourselves an equal opportunity to win a Model Y on a monthly raffle or a Tesla Roadster 2.0. Yes, that's correct, a Tesla Roadster 2.0. In addition, you also get 1,000 miles of free unlimited supercharging if you use the referral code in the description. And again, you have to order through the link of the description. And if you order in person, make sure you give the referral name and number um, from the description to the sale associate to make that order. Thanks for watching. Remember to subscribe and catch you guys next time.